Statistics from the registry at the Uganda Cancer Institute show that there are more than 300 new cases of cancer per every 100,000 people. Seems to be taking the lead. These mainly suffer from cervical, lung, brain cancer, and Kaposi sarcoma, among others. What is worrying is that 80% of these patients die within one year of being diagnosed with cancer. In view of this trend, doctors are advocating for free cancer treatment across the country to reduce the mortality rate. They argue that on average a patient needs over 3 million shillings to start cancer treatment which many Ugandans cannot afford. Most of our population, because of poverty, they cannot afford. And we cannot condemn them to death just simply because cancer treatment is expensive. So that is something which government has to take over. So I think the mandate is really for the government to come up and provide all the care for cancer patients. Actually, cancer treatment should be part of the National Health Insurance Scheme when it comes into place. These doctors and other medical experts from Africa, Asia and Europe are attending a national conference of cancer and palliative care being held in Munyonyo, Kampala. The conference is looking at developing new strategies and partnerships in treating cancer. Prime Minister Dr. Hakana Rugunda has given assurance of government's commitment to having cancer treatment available at various health centers across the country. Government has plans to establish regional cancer centers in order to make it easier for patients from different corners of Uganda to access uh, cancer care, cancer diagnosis much more easily. We don't pay our doctors so well, but the fact that these doctors, these specialists, the oncologists, the hematologists, have opted to serve despite that bigger pain is commendable. At the same event, the Uganda Cancer Institute celebrated 50 years of existence. Statistics from the National Cancer Institute shows that 80% of the cancer patients take long to go to the hospitals to receive treatment. This means that there is need to create more awareness on how to treat this deadly disease. Habad Ziwa, NTV, Kampala.